parents' house. Just went and got my hair done from a girl I went to high school with. And she did an awesome job. It looks so good. I'm so happy with it. I mean, if you have been noticing my hair pre prior to this, uh, you would see that it was like five different colors because I haven't had it dyed in so long. But now, I'm driving. Don't vlog and drive. But I'm going to Jonathan's apartment. Did a video on his apartment tour um, a couple weeks ago. But gonna go to his apartment. I've gotta go to CVS, pick up some medicine while I'm here in Georgia. And then we are going to eat lunch. It is 11.30 right now. I had my hair appointment at 9. So, it looks awesome. I'm so happy. Uh, I feel like a new person. I look awful at that angle, but whatever. So, catch ya later. At Jonathan's apartment, I found some trash in my car. So I'm going to try to put it in his trash can, by the way. Without him seeing me, because then he'll be mad that I'm putting my car trash in his trash can. Hello, dog. Come on, dog. What's she shredding? So here's the hair in better light. It's very soft, actually. But compared to before, it looks amazing. I don't know what to do about this piece. Maybe do that. Right there. Wow! <laughs> Alright, Jonathan and I are in Griffin going to Milltown Gourmet for lunch. Got it, hell. So we're gonna see what they have because we've never been. <laughs> An onion? <laughs> Lasagna? Lasagna. We're live. So I already tried to record this once, but the microphone was cut. So, what I already had said was, yesterday we went shopping and I had left my skin care at home. So I wanted to buy some face wash. Um, so I went to the Clinique counter because they had an acne wash there. And then, um, the lady told me that they had a free gift with a $29 purchase that ended yesterday, actually. So yesterday was the only, only day that you could have gotten the gift bag. So all of these products you can still buy elsewhere. But um, the first thing I bought individually was the Clinique Acne Solution which I already um, tried to use once last night just to see how it would um, make my skin react. So far, so good. Um, I still have one breakout here. And I had a few on my forehead, but they actually look a lot better today. 
also, it's a um, cleansing gel. They also had a few more. There was a foam, there was a gel, and then there was a scrub, I think. And this one's specifically for acne. Um, it says it's for all skin types. Um, fragrance free, all skin types, allergy tested. Um, that's about all it says. It's salicylic acid, if that helps. Um, that's usually what I use. I've been using Neutrogena for years, but I ran out. So I went and bought that one. Um, then I wanted to push the purchase over the $29 limit that you had to have to to get the free gift. So um, I asked if they had anything for lips because I'm always either losing my chapstick or in need of a chapstick. But this is called a Sweet Pot. It's a sugar scrub and lip balm. So this is in the color 04 Sweet Rose. It looks like this. It's actually a lot lighter when it is on your lip. So I'll just open it and see. This is the moisturizing side. Focus! I hope that that microphone is not picking up when the camera is auto focusing. But, and then there's this side, if I can get it all. This side is a sugar scrub. So I'm assuming that you put on the sugar scrub first and either, well, let's read the directions. <laughs> there are none. So I've just been putting on the sugar scrub first, exfoliating and then putting on the moisturizer. That's just what I thought would be the correct way to do it, but it's a really pretty color. I can actually put it, I'll put it on in a second. But, so the gift came in this makeup bag here. Really cute. I used to have an Ipsy subscription and they would send you bags every month. This is the size of an Ipsy bag and this was the size of the free gift bag, so I liked that. It was a little bit bigger than I was used to. And then um, in the gift bag, it came with a seven day scrub cream. So this one is a rinse off formula, allergy tested. Um, you're supposed to rinse it off after applying to makeup free skin and avoid the eye area. That's what that looks like. I tried that this morning. And um, it was a lot more exfoliating. My skin was a little bit red, but my skin was really sensitive in the first place. It was red for a little bit, but then it just looked really glowy for the next few hours. It didn't irritate it or make it break out at all. So I didn't mind that. And then it came with the Clinique Take the Day Off. I'm assuming this is like an eye makeup remover. It's in like a travel size bottle, but it looks like I can get a lot of use out of that. And then it came with Clinique All About the Eyes Under Eye Cream. I did use this last night. Obviously, I haven't been sleeping a whole lot <laughs> this week. Why is it not focusing? Focus, focus. What? And I used it last night. Don't know if the bags under my eyes look any better, but um, it was kind of thick and a little bit sticky, but no. Also came with the Clinique Pretty easy eyeliner. This is a liquid. Why? Focus, focus. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. Anyway, liquid felt. It looks like a felt tip, honestly. I'm not quite sure, but. Definitely looks like it would be a lot easier to use than what 
I'm normally used to like a it's not a very long applicator so that's good and then the Clinique High Impact Mascara this is a travel size also applicator looks like that almost out of mascara also so that's a good thing and it came with this little mini eyeshadow little pod here and then you open it up slides out like this and it is a pink and a uh, looks like a dark moth color it looks brown but it is like a pinkish brown sort of um but yeah i'm gonna look and see if there are any cotton swabs so i can see how the makeup remover works one second all right couldn't find a cotton pad so just gonna use a tissue, open it like a pharmacy bottle here. Dump it like that, and let's see. I don't have a lot of mascara on right now, but it is an oily consistency. I don't think that it's irritating my eyes at all, which is good. Um, I used to use something like this that was a different brand and definitely irritated my eyes a little lot more than this one. But uh, I guess I'll have to wait a few minutes because the other one that I used to use would make my eyes just water uncontrollably. Eyes are sensitive, skin is sensitive, all that. Also have to be careful with rubbing my eyes after getting laser eye surgery. So that didn't take long at all. And looks pretty good to me. Feels okay. Feels like, um, feels really oily actually. Weird. I don't think I want to use the exfoliating one tonight. Um, it says makeup free skin, which my face is, I didn't wear any makeup today. Um, but I think I'm gonna use the acne solutions tonight. After a couple of days of using it, how it is going to help clear up my face a lot because I don't normally break out. And I think I only started breaking out because I ran out of my previous face wash so i put about that much don't do that obviously not a pro at this <laughs> it says it's a gel but it's not it's not really uh, foaming up like any kind of soap would. I'm just, I mean, I put a, a pretty good amount, so. Let that sit there a second. And then I wet my washcloth and then wash my shelf. I don't do an excessive amount of water. I'm gonna wash it off here. I like to use a washcloth also because it just gives a texture to where Gets the dead skin off, whatever. Extra make off, make up, make off. <laughs> I really want to try to use that mascara just to see how it works. I may or may not wash it back off. But, so let's see. I'm just gonna do the under eye cream. That was just one little pat inside of the pod it's really creamy and it, it did dry 
I did not wake up in the morning with it. Um, like, standing still under my eyes. So there's that. Okay. And then we will just put on the sugar scrub here. I don't really pick up a lot of the um, exfoliator whenever I'm like digging my fingers in. Mm, I just got some of it. It feels like have um salt on your lips. Rub those together. I don't know if I'm supposed to rub it off or not. I guess I will. Just because it feels weird to have like salt on your lips. But this is the color. Sweet rose. Put it back in the box. All right, and that's that. I think I'm gonna wait to use the makeup products tomorrow. Um, definitely, really don't wanna sleep in any makeup tonight. Um, so I'm just gonna see how all these work tomorrow, see how all these products work on my face. I'll use the scrub cream again in the morning to see how my face does throughout the day again. Put everything back. Gonna get ready for bed. And we'll see you in the next video.